Hey guys, Delphi here again, and I'm back on my character doing an hour a day in Guild Wars 2. Um, and still joking, apparently. So yeah, I changed her look up a little bit. I got the tattoo packages, and I like the serpent ones. Um, and I just kind of randomized the color with the colors, so. Which is a fun feature if you haven't played around with it. You could probably waste an hour every day doing it. Because if you go into dyes... You can randomize. You don't have to apply it, but anyways, you apply. It'll only use dyes that you have, obviously, so. Oh, I think I like that one better. See? I'm gonna change her right now. You can also randomize your armor, but I've seen somebody do it, and it looks wonky as shit, so. Anyways, there we go. We are blue and yellow. So, we are going to drum roll. Uh, we're gonna start Path of Fire right now, so. Uh, Heals assistant. I want that up, but uh, anyway, I thought it was a midriff, but I'm still sad. I still want it. But anyways, uh, we're gonna start by the fire, so yay! Phoenix Dawn is set to sail. Glad you could join us, Commander. Thanks. How's the crew? Ships prepped. Like Eight supplies business. are in the hull, and we've got a lion guard squad for security. Hop aboard, and we'll shove off. But the crew, you can speak freely. Well, some people, not me. Are a no. little anxious. There are mixed feelings about fighting a god. We have our orders. If you listen to the refugees' stories, it's pretty obvious whatever Balthazar's doing over there is a catastrophe. I'm all excited, and it's like horrible refugees' stories. He was determined to take a dragon's power. I guess he's turned his attention to Krakatoric. And apparently doesn't care whose neck he has to step on to get the job done. When you stop to think about it, this is a god who turned against us. It's hard to swallow. I suppose we'll just have to stop him from killing it and get ourselves some answers. Oh, don't even get me started on sparing the dragons. Believe me, I'm still coming to terms with it, too. Hopefully time he can prove it. And soon. Then I'll hold my tongue on that and let you focus on Balthazar and his forged. Huh. Let me guess. It's what the refugees call his army. Tough customers by the sound of it. An army. Yep. Wonder where that came from. Only one place you'll find an answer. A diplomatic team is already on the ground in Amnoon. I'd start with them. Will do. You sure you're ready to follow me into the fire? It's where we do our best work. Good. Off to the furnace, then. Sparking the flame. There's a lot of fire theme going on. Just in case you're wondering. Oh, it's cool music. I was playing the game when this came out and I remember being so stoked and it came out kind of around my birthday. My birthday's in August, like the beginning, and this came out around the end. September or something like that. It was awesome. I pre-ordered it for my birthday, basically. It's a pretty cool cutscene, actually. I literally haven't played this sort of since it came out, so... Doesn't look like we made it to Amnoon. Sorry for the change of plans, but we saw smoke coming from that pyramid. 2017, I couldn't remember when it came out. Orders. September 22nd. So Kind of over there, the ruins. Caves like horror. <laughs> if you'd like to stay on board, we'll get you to Amnoon as soon as we get back. I didn't come this far to sightsee. I'm going with you. 
Oh, they're going that way. I'm like, how do I get on of this thing? That way, apparently, is how I get off of this thing. So this is where you would have gotten your first raptor. That came from inside. Oh, I don't Take a look around. So yeah, there's a lot of fire happening. Just be prepared for that. Me, they're killing for sport. These must be the forge we heard about. Let's wait for that introduction until after we're done. There are any left, eh, Commander? So obviously, um, they were a lot tougher when we were first doing it. Also, I was on an Ellie, and that was. I wasn't sure if it would let me summon my raptor because you get it later. Just, so, just, oh, I want to revive this guy while we're trying to do Eh, maybe I do. My, my minion's got this. Okay, maybe I don't. Has he? Join him and fill the crystal dragon. He only wants to free Tyria from their grasp. Your god lies, and waging war on these people won't help you defeat the dragon. That was unwise. Yeah, he went full bad guy. Like, he could have just been like, whatever, I'll just go kill a dragon and say something. Why we can't have nice things though, I'm sorry. It's actually kind of sad, like the, um... Oh. Uh, a lot of the, um... Main storylines I've only done once. Like, I've gone through so the Living World ones to get achievements and stuff like that. Obviously, there's achievements you can get in these ones, too, but I just... I remember them being tough, and maybe it was the class I was playing, or maybe it was... I mean, six years have gone by, so... Five and a half years. But, I mean, they're... You know, this is a tough battle. So it's a boss battle, I can expect. This is kind of neat. I'm glad I'm doing this and then I'm sharing it with people who probably don't care. <laughs> I don't mind that. I have to avoid attack, and I don't know what that attack is, so I'm just trying to avoid this. Okay, there, there. Yeah, I shouldn't gender people. I'm working on that. Oh, okay, they're saying she. Cool. Be yeah, ready no, for any other survivors I send your way. Bye, Commander. But I still shouldn't miss it. Head to the pyramid for safety. We have forces standing by to protect you. When they just be like, what the actual F are you? Because like they've never seen a Savari before. But... I was once like you, but on no balloons 
That looks like a lot of fire. And my minions are just like, what else? I can't remember exactly when you get a raptor, but I'm pretty sure it's in this instance. I could be wrong. I actually forgot that I changed the looks when I logged in. I was like, what am I wearing? I'm like, oh. Yeah. It's still up, so hopefully I'm going to get it. I think I feel like it's not a Was I supposed to wait in the... <laughs> they just like ran right past me too, what the hell? I didn't realize it had been that long since... I thought it was 2018 for some reason. But it's got a pretty decent story, so... I mean, I... Someone should be pulling these fires out. They, they're gone. Oh, thank you. I need to get through that gate. I, I, okay, I'll just. Oh, I. If it's down, she must have smashed it on her way through. I can gather whoever's left to get the gate open. But you have to help us. The town's burning out of control. Of course, but maybe you should hang back. Yes, please. Oxane, your leg doesn't look good. I can't just sit here. It's okay. We'll handle this. You're helping by helping me. Fine, fine. Just please don't let the entire village burn to the ground. Help the survivors. The raptors will get you to anyone who's out of reach. Got it. And you? I'm fine. I'll stay with my brother. Okay. Shout if you need anything. Commander, I've got something that might help with those fires. Here, take this. You carry a fire extinguisher with you? Well, Keel said we should bring insurance for the voyage. <laughs> Use a raptor to rescue the villagers. Here, exactly. <laughs> I'm just 
can get up this fire I can. Great. So yeah, they would give you a training raptor here. So you might have to, every time you get off of it, you might have to go find another one, but don't use another one. Wrong button. F and G are right beside each other, right? So... <laughs> we'll pretend that's what happened. I mean, that is what have happened. have our gratitude, stranger. You'll be in our prayers tonight. Like I'm basically doing the heart quest here, it's kind of weird. Thank you. You've done us a great service, and we will honor you for it. And we will honor you for it. Oh, that's nice. Oh. Okay, it's just standing there. I guess they carry a fire extinguisher because, uh, of me <laughs> which is probably That was smooth. Oh! Alright, so it is working. I'm just not hitting it in time, I guess. The space bar sometimes gives me fits. So those are the training raptors, those little stars that you have to get over. Yeah, villagers. Oh, good thing you showed up. The Amnoon Cavaliers can't protect us. I'm just gonna like they're right on that plane, and I feel like if I bring them back, they're just gonna die again. That'd be awkward. Thank you. Oh, there he is. Looks like the raptor's taken to you. I mean, Keep I already it. have it, so... For your help. Are you sure? One less raptor is the least of our problems. Thanks. It'll help you cover ground faster. <laughs> You'll need it. The mine gate is operational again. Go through there. It'll take you to Amnu. And Outlander, please pay this tragedy back for us. I will. Alright, use the mount hop key to summon your mount. I can't remember exactly what it was. Mine is I've changed them around, so get the card. Barbarian at dawn. Close that I've been again still doing those. I got some of them done yesterday though, yay. Oh, I'm glad to see you. I got trapped in here with these things. We have to run. Can I climb on? I'm not in a running mood. How about I take care of them for you? Uh, all of them? Just head back that way. The gate's working now. Okay, but at least let your beast strike the first blow if you're gonna fight. Yeah, kind of teaching you how to 
you as you wrap your mount, basically. <laughs> It's kind of nice because if you get a group of them, it pulls them all together and then you see things. the Sea of Sorrows. I'm here to stop Balthazar. <laughs> yeah, me too. <laughs> oh, you're serious? Then hi and welcome. That would be quite an appreciated feat. Have you seen his herald? An armored woman. Didn't come this way. Hmm. No sign of her. Try Amnoon. Lots of folks are going there. Take the road south and you'll hit it. I'll check it out. See what help I can find. Try to reach you later. Repeat, I'll try to reach you later. Hello. I'm just going to assume you heard that. Halt. What's your business in Amnoon? In case you haven't noticed, there's a mob of people trying to get in. I was told a party from Divinity's Reach is here. I need to speak with them. Also, a village north of here was attacked. My crew is helping the survivors, but they could use Amnoon's support. Hmm. Wait here while I clear this with the Council. Captain Raheem, I can vouch for the Commander. This is the leader of the guild I told you about. As a welcome sight. This is the Dragon Slayer. Well, it wasn't a solo effort, but yeah. The Commander's taken down one or two. Ritlock? What? Has. You're here on behalf of the Queen. Correct. But just a moment. Captain, does the Commander have permission to enter? Yes, a high Commander. Catch up with your friends and come see me at the Cavalier Station. We should talk. Ooh, all right. So let's go, and then we're in the Crystal Desert. So when it, um, oh, I have a mail. I think they sent me, interesting, and a hastily written letter. Oh, letter, 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 my goodness. Yeah. All right, let's, oops, let's see what I got here. I probably have them all. I do. I will get the light one to break down for them. Garb. Okay. Alrighty, so... was the race. There's races that are happen with the mounts, and the, the one starts right here. Um, there's also 
this that I got when I pre-ordered uh, Path of Fire. And I know people are like, don't pre-order games. But I'm like, it's expansion. It was whatever. I pre-ordered it. Um, you get stuff. I like that. So, yeah. So there's... It's kind of a little area off over there where it has all yeah, the crafting and all that stuff. So, But let's see. I need to catch up with Captain Rahim at the Unknown Cavalier Station. Yeah, the race is happening. That's what that is. It's a mount race. It's kind of cool. Sorry for the gate earlier. I get all kinds of people in here. And the stories they tell to get inside. Not that I blame them. But the city can only take so many before bursting. So, Stand on this desk. I take it you're here for both, Asama. I am. I'm looking for a place to start. Any information you have would be helpful. Hmm. Well, your guildmates are being hosted by the chief counselor at the Civic Center. She can fill you in about the state of the city and the surrounding area. And she might know something about Balthazar, too. Sounds good. Anything from the ground level. Someone who's dealt with him or his army firsthand. My deputy Ayub is at the camp run by Komir's priesthood. The refugees there may need help. And then there's... Hmm. How do you feel about getting a little lower than ground level to find what you want? I have a deputy assigned to the local smugglers, the Hamasin. Name a case. Not so sure he's mine anymore. But you might seek him out, if you don't mind walking on that side of the line, of course. I think I can stomach it. You'll find them at the casino. Tread lightly. Reports of creatures driven insane by lay energy are coming from all over. The refugee camp. The Choya were introduced. They're, um, I don't know if this guy will pop up. I kinda, well, I mean, okay, yeah, his face is horrible, but he's cute, okay? He's. <laughs> and you're like, and you just killed him. Yes, I did. Rahim pointed me in your direction. Would you mind if I talk to a few of the refugees about Balthazar? You're welcome to try. Not a lot of folks are in a talking mood. This camp's gonna be no better than the place where they fled if we can't get more aid out here soon. I'll see what I can do. Maybe people will be more inclined to talk when they feel safer. We certainly wouldn't say no to some help. Priestess Karima can tell you what we need most. Good fortune to you. Oh, help priestess. Okay, well, it's basically a, okay, she has an apple over her head, so I go to the food. And she wants food. Oh, there's priestess Karima. Thank you. And hurt refugee obviously wants medical supplies. You're very kind. No, he's thirsty, so he wants some water. Oh, they're just lining up Thank here. You. I won't forget this. May I have some water? More water. Okay. You're very kind. Thank I'm you. I'm so hungry. Oh, I noticed that. That must be Thank part you. of the story. I won't forget I'm so this. thirsty. Thirsty. Okay. I'll have to go find you water. Because there's none in there. But there's other spots around that have them. Cormir is blind to the troubles of our world. Cormir's moved beyond us. Balthazar sees you. Balthazar knows you. Serve him. You're very kind. Thank you. Throw off the chains of your false gods. Don't lie to Join the people. ranks of the Zaishan Order. Drove them here. We will suffer no blasphemy. Oh, 
Oh, must have hit something by accident. I think I hit that. There's also an event over here. Somebody else doing that. I got my, my heart done, so that'll help towards my completion. Actually, I wanted to check that other one where I did over there. No, it didn't. Just kind of felt like it should, right? But that's okay. You do use your raptor in that one, so that's why I was curious. What happened to you out in the desert? We very nearly didn't make it out alive. We escaped the salt flats right before a forged invasion. Balthazar has turned the whole desert upside down and... I'm sorry. I don't want to talk about it anymore. Excuse me. Can you tell me what happened to you? I... We left a group hiding from forged attacks in Destiny's Gorge after walking out of the Elon Riverlands to the south. We thought we were in the clear, but... but we were followed. I, I had a chance to run, and I... I took it. I still hear the screams. I ran when it started, and... Oh, Dwayne, forgive me. I'm a coward. I should have died with them. No. You shouldn't have. We take heart. Both is our will pay for this. What happened to you out in the desert? We were coming down from the highlands when you ran into a branded ambush. No one would have survived if Blast hadn't flown in and saved us. Blast? You know, the dragon? Lent's offspring. Don't you mean Gleam? Gleam was the name the bards gave him. But his true name is Blast. He's a savior with wings. We owe him our lives. That's... That's the first Scion. Orlean's brother. He's a good dragon? He carries on his mother's work. Cormir praise him. Where can I find that. him? No one knows where he roosts. He just shows up to contest the branded. So Orin has a brother. That's great news. I hope. Excuse me. Can you tell me what happened to you? We fled north to escape Balthazar's forged. They've been marching the same way lately, up into the highlands. Oh, at this rate, we'll run out of places to retreat to in no time flat. It's time to move on. Cormir is blind to the troubles of our world. Cormir's moved beyond us. So again, like the Living World Season 3, um, when you complete a heart it's completed but the next day you can come back and complete it again and if you need to buy anything from the merchant you need to buy it or you need to unlock it again so well the choya stampede i don't know why it's just one of my favorite events it's so fun i don't really want to do it right now but they come in and they smash everything it's hilarious What do you want? You case. Maybe. Who's asking? 
Captain Rahim Me, sent clearly? me. He's under the impression that you have access to Hamasin's network. Yeah? He's wrong. So beat it. Listen carefully, friend. I'm here to kill the god of war. Don't think I won't swap me flies that get in my way. Well, if that's your angle, then you need Zalambor. He runs things. He is the Homocene's network. He's usually in his office in the casino. But he's a very busy man. I'm sure he'll spare a few moments for me. Oh, raptors. I wonder if they enforce that. Nope. Had to find out. <laughs> so yeah, you can gamble Ectos here. Sandstone, what's that? Uh, oof. uh let's go with that one. So, did I buy it? You open it, costs you that much, and then, oh, I got more. So there. Sometimes you get less, though, because, you know, gambling. So, <laughs> just be prepared for that. Oh, it's an instance. Okay. Bring me things I can't find locally. Get you access to a vast. You must be Zalambor. I am. My friends, let's adjourn for now. In the meantime, my casino is yours. Enjoy the Grand Sahil's many luxuries. You spared me from a few more minutes of dealing with those smugglers. For this, I owe you. But next time, make an appointment. Maybe I should explain why I'm here. Oh, I know why you're here, Commander. What I don't know is what it's got to do with me. Elonian wine? I'll pass. No, no, you I'll sure? take some. It's not poisoned or anything. Hey, maybe not. I'm offended, Salambor. You've never once offered me wine. Ah, I present to you Archon Iberu of the Morden Crescent. Archon? The commanders come to us all the way from Lion's Arch. Our friend here was once a sunspear who opposed Joko, but it amuses his majesty to break and domesticate his enemies. Careful, Zalambor. As I'm sure you're aware, Chief Counselor Iman invited me here to discuss military aid for Amnoon. It's vital to King Joko's interest that this alliance goes through. Amnoon is among the last of the holdouts. And now, I hear you've been voicing your dissent. Arka. For the sake of our guest, might we drop the innuendo and get to the point? You're right. Here's the point. Uh. What are you? No. Upon the next meeting of the council, your laptop counselor will have a speech. I mean, I'm stuck. Yeah, let me move. Close to him, I guess. Oh, he's over there. Okay, I'm gonna stop hitting him. No. 
on, buddy. So there's actually the Scourge, I think it is, the Necro um, specialization for this area. It doesn't use minions, it uses like these sand... I'm not sure what they're called off the top of my head. Um, but yeah, they, they're they like sand the things and they use them because they don't want Necromancy, the dead, because of Joko, so... Happy to help. Mainly because now you own me. The fact that I'm still able to walk is a point in your favor for sure. And this time of war does make for strange bedfellows. Gormir knows I've had worse. I'm only after Balthazar, you understand? I can't be dragged down by whatever else you've got going on. My organization makes it possible for me to do many things. Fund public works, donate to our refugee guests. Keep candle after candle burning at Cormir's temples. <sighs> I never wanted to cross the Morden Crescent, but I suppose it was inevitable. I'm grateful you were here for the Archon's overture, so I'll keep an ear to the ground on your behalf. Hey. And last but not least... <laughs> Office of the Chief Counselor. Sure. Your guildmates were just regaling us with tales of your adventures. You honor us. It's not every day a dragon slayer walks through our door. The counselor must have misunderstood my part of the story, or she wouldn't be bending over backward to inflate your ego. Well, thank you for the compliment. But this time, I'm not after a dragon. I'm after Balthazar. Do you have any information on his whereabouts? The god himself? We only know he's constantly on the move, chasing who knows what. And that Amnoon is essentially surrounded by his troops, which maybe you have some insight into. We're at a bit of an impasse. Joko's government sent representatives of the Morden Crescent to Amnoon to offer military support against the Forged. I think I ran into those representatives at the casino. There may be fewer of them now. The Morden Crescent may no longer be the honorable sun spheres they once were. But they would make powerful allies. And in a time like this, there's actually an achievement. Yet. You people have history books. Open any one of them and it'll tell you short term gains bring long term Or trouble. getting them to do all three, basically. The Chief Counselor has the right idea. We should be grateful the Morden Crescent are even considering helping us. We should fly Joko's standard and make it clear we welcome his kingdom's support. Ah. The lap dog. We've resisted Joko for years. I'm not about to let him waltz in. And without a fight, it's called now. Want to look it up? It's nonsense. Our only option is to align ourselves with Cormier's priesthood and the remaining sun spheres. Allying with either side will only lead to future conflict. And Noon has been independent and should remain independent. <sighs> and round and round it goes. I'd welcome any counsel you might have, Commander. Well, it's easy for your char friend to dismiss the threat we face. Joko is nobody's first choice, but we can't afford to turn down the Archon's offer. The Morden Crescent are the only ones with the strength to ensure our survival. Your survival? Do you want to survive as a member of Joko's awakened army? The Sun Spear's numbers are weakened, but their involvement could still be a beacon of hope. Their order has sacrificed everything to defy Joko and the Morden Crescent. They'll protect us from the Forged. Amnoon must remain independent. Our doors have always been open. It's how we survive this long. The moment we pick a side, we're asking for trouble from the others. And you, Counselor, 
You're awfully quiet over there. There are no good options here. All of these plans are suicidal. I can't dose any of them. Kind of fair. Spear Marshal Cormier was a local hero. Even before she fought a fallen god and took his power. <laughs> Her sun spheres have always encouraged these people to keep fighting. Even when darkness is closing in. We may be a small group now. But an alliance with the Sun Spheres would be the light in the dark the city needs. These people should just look out for themselves. The minute these yapping windbags let a creature like Joko into this city, they give up any hope of freedom. He might be the biggest gun around here, but what happens after the Forged are defeated? Every decision you make has a cost. In this case, all the people have to do is serve Joko forever after they die. What a deal! I'm not sure if I have to choose it here, so I'm gonna pause and I'm just gonna look up real quick, so I'll be right back. Hey, I'm back. So yes, um, it's actually under collections, under basic collections. There's Raise the Banners and Independence, which I've apparently done. Um, but there is a collection for these ones require you to do either the Sun Spear or Joko. Um, which sort of unlocks. So it's a collection, not a... I mean, you get achievement points for it. So I'm gonna actually pick... I'm gonna be naughty and pick Joko, because it's funny. Um, and you do have to pick it here. So, uh, resist... Accept. An unconventional decision, and not what I expected. It, it affects some things, you. but I don't know. I'm curious we'll accept the help of the Morden Crescent. It's our best chance of survival. We do what we must for now. And we'll deal with Joko after the Forged have fallen. There's also... Enjoy your afterlife of servitude. Oh, no. So wise, Chief Counselor. Joko will be pleased. And you've ensured... And this one here, where there's like always the time for time or something. see this as salvation. May Cormier forgive us. A moment, Commander. But now I'm not seeing that one either. But changes the ban not that banner, but these banners, I think, so. These people are desperate. Caught up in a war they don't understand. Balthazar came to the desert for Krakator, not for them. But why? Why is he doing it? This is why I wanted you to pick the Sun Spheres. To represent Cormir. She might guide us to answers or intervene in Balthazar's actions. Especially if his goal is noble, but his path is not. Your hope is... Inspiring. Thanks. Have you heard from Tiny? I couldn't get a clear signal. Guess I should try again. I have some big news to share. Go on. The Exalted said Orlean was Glint's second scion, but we didn't know what had happened to the first. And now? His name is Vlast. He's been carrying on Glint's work by protecting people from Kral Katorik and the Branded. That's wonderful news. Another dragon ally. I feel like Cormier is already leading us to a resolution. Tiny will be over the moon when she hears. There must be some place that's clear of interference. It looks like it's only... I'm gonna go talk to Tiny. There's one you have to do. You have to do it at each step. So I'm gonna try to do it. This one, you, you have to do it, so... No, oh, uh, I want to go this way. Do you read? Come in. <sighs> I must not be getting a signal. I'm here, Commander. I read you. Glad you made it to the Crystal Desert in one piece. You are in one piece, right? So far. Yes. <laughs> Did you duke it out with the fire guy yet? What's happening? The fire update, guy. <laughs> update now. Balthazar's got the desert in chaos. I'm trying to find the shortest route to him to... Well, you know. 
But I think the biggest news I've heard is Stabby the story Stabby. about a dragon, Lust. Supposedly, he's another scion of Glint, Aurene's brother. What? Well, tell me all about it with his high wingspan powers. Did he eat anybody in front of you? <laughs> what? I haven't met him yet, but I'll let you know. How are things in Radanovis? It's hard to change people's minds with conjecture, so I'm trying to prove that killing dragons isn't ideal. I'm also trying to get all the Dragon Lab info into Scruffy so I can become more mobile. It's a madhouse in the lab now. They're keeping tours. Tours! Ugh. Poor Tiny. Speaking of which, here comes one now. Check back in when you get a chance. Turn back right at you if I have links for a hostile takeover. And then just telling them to come in, basically. Will be valuable to you. I summon your guildmates to meet me in my cas to meet you in my casino so that you are all guilty. I'm just gonna look up that tiny one because I can't find it. It's like... So yeah, did a search for it and I'm missing like one, so I'll just have to do all of them. But it's fine. Um Hopeless point of interest here. So I'll just keep that up. I'll try to be doing it as I go, basically. This is the best way. Why is there still no plan to get rid of all the sand bearing our home? What if I just waltz in? We can go right up here. Okay. Hopefully, this isn't too long. You should have seen Iman's face when we said we were leaving because we were invited to the casino by its owner. <laughs> Anyone who gets that reaction out of a stuffed shirt almost made me think I might like this Zalambur guy. I heard he donates generously to Cormier's priesthood. They fell over themselves to bless his name. Maybe Amnun should put him in charge. I'm surprised that council's not debating the merits of pyramids versus cubes. You might want to meet him before endorsing him for political office. <laughs> Kanark, what are you doing here? Enjoying your time off? Freedom is a sweet drink, Commander. I've been busy quenching my thirst. You should join us. We were just about to meet with- Zalambur. I already know a thing or two about this place. <laughs> a silver gambler who's up 500 gold is just my cover. I promise you. Now that he's free, it's okay if I kill but him. But why? Right? He's Gentlemen, awesome. let's keep it civil. How about it, Kanak? While my freedom's been gratifying, it's also a little boring. This is much more interesting. Besides, I may have made a wager that the Slayer of Elder Dragons can take down a god, and I intend to collect. What are the odds? <laughs> <laughs> Let's not jinx it, Commander. Never tell me the odds. Sorry. Oh, uh, Kanak, I forgot. It's just these little things you forget. And I'm like, the story is kind of cool. It kind of is. Welcome back, Commander. It's an honor to have the members of Dragon's Watch in my humble establishment. Please, follow me. The Grand Zaheel is already just back to running at these at pictures are kind of cool. In no small part your early intervention we have all the finest games and entertainment the crystal desert has to offer do you enjoy games of chance when the odds are in our favor i reached out across my network for information about balthazar and i think i know what he's after krakatoric you're half right he's currently hunting down a crystal dragon but that dragon is a blast I wonder why he'd suddenly change targets. Who among us can understand the will of a god? I do know his forged army has encampments all over the Crystal Desert. He stops at these camps to rally his troops while he's on the dragon's trail. So we might be able to intercept him at one of the forged camps. You've come through, Zalambor. I actually don't regret keeping you alive. The feeling is mutual, Commander. I'll take my leave. Enjoy your time here, please. Stay away from the high stakes roulette. It's rigged. I knew it. <laughs> so, 
Mac is so up for a trip to one of these camps. Sounds good to me. Let's shut him down before he's responsible for anyone else's death. We don't want to rush in blindly. And if I'm going to be joining you again, I may as well make myself useful. I'll scout the main camp, see what I see, and report back. The main camp? On your own? Seems risky. Nah, not alone. I'll go with him. Hmm. Not the response I expected. Hey, vacations have a way of dulling a blade, so to speak. Can't let you fumble around unsupervised. That's wow. more like it. <laughs> All right. Kaz and I will check out the smaller outposts. Actually, I'll leave it to you if you don't mind. I have some matters to attend to. There's a temple of Kormir near one of the forged camps. You can find me there when you're done. Going through and playing this story, though... Oh, see, I got that, and I got this. Nice. Um, so I have to do different things. I'll we'll have to do that one of these days. I found that like, there must have been like little side stories that they have, and they must have kind of filled in the blanks, because she had just freaked out because Balthazar was betrayed us and blah 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 and now she's back um i think that might have been explained kind of a little bit but yeah she got over it basically nobody cared she got over it because <laughs> there would have been time right in between each each story there would have been months between and then between one path ends and path of fire there would have been time as well so So I think the banners change, yeah, outside the... Is this the Eminem Civic Center? I can't see, yep. Or Cavalier Center, so the banners change because we're now aligned with Joko. I said there was a way to check, so... Captain, I'm glad I caught you. A high commander. It would seem you survived the den of vipers in Zalambor's casino. Zalambor was reluctantly helpful. He said the Forged had set up camps in the area. My team is scouting the main camp, but I need to know where any of the smaller posts might be. Actually, there are two Forged outposts outside the city walls. They mostly provide reinforcements and tactical support for the main camp. It would make sense to take those out before attacking the main camp, then. Kill the cavalry before they can come to the rescue. And it might cut back their raids on our city. You'll find one outpost to the north, and the other to the east. I've posted my cavaliers outside them. They can fill you in on what to expect inside. Alright. However, I think I am going to stop here. Um, because, you know, it's about that time. So, yeah, we'll stop here and we'll uh, keep on going with... Uh, with the story in the next one. So yeah, you get the raptor now. Um, you would have gotten masteries for it. It's path by raptor mount. So tailspin now deals greatly increased damage. Um, oh, that pulls in canyon jumping, so it goes further. Um, yeah. So I mean, this this is the well, that's nice, but this is the main one. It's great. Um, obviously all the other mounts have them too. Crystal Champion. Oh, I think that comes afterwards. Anyways. Um, so yeah, we don't get the, the Springer mount right away. Uh, but you do need- you get these ones, um, just by kind of doing the story or going through the maps. And then these ones are kind of afterwards. <laughs> these three are special, especially this guy's scale is a bit of a grind again. But I mentioned that, but... So, anyways, like I said, I'm going to stop here, and uh, I will see you guys in the next one.